Good morning. Uh, today I would continue to, to talk about gold. <clears throat> this is the uh, United States Commodity Future Trading Commission's report. It's a weekly report, and that's the latest one, February 23rd. Look at metals, short form. Then we type in gold, and I found the report here. It's rather complicated and a lot of insider information that's not easy to understand. But I would only look at this column, the managed money, and that is the smart money. These are very intelligent guys. They are the trading firms, the managed fund, um, mutual fund, and so on, the hash fund. These people are intelligent. Now let's see what their movement. They are adding long here and short must last and you have reduced a lot of short positions and, in, and only reduce comparatively, comparatively less reduction in the long position. Therefore, the conclusion is what? That the market is moving long, isn't it? That means the price in the medium term would rise. But having said that, Trading is another issue. Trading is not investment. Trading is a kind of gambling. So we never argue with the market. Even though I bought here yesterday and the price rose a bit but fell and hit my stop loss. So I stopped out with loss here. Then I wish then I just switch over switch over to the uh, bearish side, to the downside, and in a moment, the gain I have is almost covered the loss that I did uh, yesterday. Now that is the profit I make at the moment. Uh, what the hell if it uh, uh, go up again and hit my stop loss here? What shall I do? Then I'll we'll go to the long side. The only thing that I can do, you know, uh, as a trader, you cannot argue with the market, and you must stick to the game plan and stick to the rules. It's just like a soldier. We never argue with the commander. And the commander is my technical indicators and my stop loss. I enter here because of a part of the momentum and I stopped out because of the the game plan that I I, I did. I put a tight stop and a stop out, and I tolerate the loss. And then I, I re-enter the market on the bearish side because the momentum is going down. So that is, uh, if I lost, if I made the loss, the loss uh, because of. Uh, luck or because of the market fluctuation, then I wouldn't feel bad. It's still a good bad, okay? If I made a, a pointless guess and I uh, won, that's actually a bad bet. So, you just go with the market telling you and don't even try to have an ego. I told Tudor Jones said that if you have a ego, if you think you're a hero, you are dead. So that's the only thing you can do. But all in all, I would think that the market, according to the court report, is more likely to go up than go down. Although as a short-term trader, I would go with the market uh, the flow, and I didn't care too much about this kind of fundamental things. Okay, thank you.